As I look at the rose that grown next door in my house. I love country music because I like to tell stories. My Africa is talented, my Africa is green, my Africa is blessed. My name is Cleopatra Metula, Mrs. Roses. I am a country music singer from Eswatini in Babane. I love traditional country music. Dolly Parton, for me she's like a goddess in country music. It's music often heard in the United States and gaining popularity in Eswatini, formerly Swaziland, thanks to singers like Cleopatra Mathula. This is country music in Swaziland. Her soothing voice can be heard telling stories throughout her home country. What happened to me? In Swaziland, country music in Swaziland is growing. In Swaziland, we are blessed because our place is very much green, mountainous, beautiful animals. We can write songs about what we have here as well and connect with the world outside. Like a fish I used to hide in the deepest waters. I saw no light, I found no love in there. Cleopatra started her professional singing career after she lost the very person who introduced her to the genre and her biggest fan. So memories I never forget involves uh, my mother saying, Cleopatra, don't stop, you have to sing or God will take away that voice. So I'd find myself singing and afraid, of course, uh, that God is going to take away the voice. Unfortunately, 2013, my mother passed away. So when she passed away, I wanted to do more. Of, of what she loved, and I also wanted to do more that I love. Payday is around the corner. Yep. Me and my sisters, um, we managed to actually write a song called These Memories. It's like, these memories will never die, they'll live forever in me. So we wrote the song for our mama. We wanted to tell her that every memory we had uh, will never actually die. It will always be there. And when we wrote the song, we didn't know who to actually contact and who to say, yay, we want this song to be out, but we wanted this song to be heard. Fortunately, on TV, we hear Dustin Stones playing, Ride With Me. Mom and I just sat up and said, this is what I'm doing. This is country music. Those boys are singing country music. After seeing them on TV and contacting them, uh, we really thought they, they never respond back to us, but they did. And it was awesome because they drove through that gravel road to see the cowgirl, that is me. And when they got there, they were excited. They said, you are just country. And they helped me record that song and helped me out as I was growing, taught me to play guitar, and today here I am. And that is where everything started. We're at Happy Valley Hotel. We're gonna be playing for like the audience here for lunch. Cleopatra says she's successful because she's surrounded by people who love and believe in her. <laughs> I'm excited today, you guys. Uh, this is my family, uh, the Metula family. Uh, let's do Indilinga. So maybe we'll just do a bit of it and then you guys... Ningai Keti Indilinga Ningai Keti Indilinga Ningai Keti Yeeha to my family I'm so proud as a big brother to support her and I'm so proud that the family is there and is supporting her. She's a wonderful singer. She can do anything. She can do anything.
Oh my word, this is an exciting evening. I'm at the Royal Swazi Convention Centre for the Swama Awards in Swaziland as Swatini. This is amazing. It's exciting because I have been nominated for the best country. So yeah, I do hope to win and I'm excited. And I'm happy that I'll be performing. So yeah, it's gonna be an awesome night. <laughs> she didn't take the award home that night, Cleopatra is looking forward to another big recognition, attending an award show in one of the states where country music thrives. Basically, this is an international country music uh, award, of course, that is actually hosted in uh, Texas. They bring uh, a different, uh, different groups and artists from different countries to represent their countries and also to actually see that there's country music in places we've actually never thought of, sang in different languages w that I love most. So it is, it is something that is very uh, big for me and my achievement. So, so that's the process. There's an inspiration and then the song and the words just flows and the melody just flows. I found myself, sometimes the things we need, they just borrow. Along with working on an album she hopes to release soon, Cleopatra uses her spare time to help young women follow their passion. I also have a meeting with ladies, kids from schools, whereby we'd actually meet and speak about music and what they like. I want to inspire girls who actually love music but they don't have the courage to do it thank you lord for your blessings on me <laughs> so for me being on stage it's something it's a dream coming true for my mother and for me yep thank you lord <laughs> yeah <laughs> awesome <laughs>